In this question, we're asked to enlarge shape A by scale factor 3 from centre negative 9, 10. If you would like to do the question alongside me, just click the link below to download the templates and print them, and then you can pause the video when you need to catch up. The first thing I'm going to do is mark the centre of enlargement at negative 9, 10. And now I'm going to draw grid line guidelines through the vertices or corners of the shape from that centre. Take care when placing your ruler that both of those points lie exactly on the ruler because these guidelines are very difficult to get completely accurate. The question asks us to enlarge by a scale factor of three. That means the new shape must be three times the size of the original shape and three times the distance from the center. So approximately over here. And it will look like it's sliding down a tunnel, getting further away or closer. Um, so I'm going to count squares in order to um, measure how far each vertex is from the center and then multiply each by three. So I don't want to forget what I've counted. So I'm going to draw some arrows on the side and write the numbers down. So the first vertex here is two across and three down, two across and it's down. So let's say negative three. Multiply those by 3, 6 across, and 9 down. So I count 6 squares across, and 3, 6, 9 down, and mark the vertex on there. And it's on the grid line, so that's really good news. The next vertex here is 2 across and 5 down. 2, negative 5, multiply by 3, 6, negative 15, 6 across and 15 down, um, 6 across and 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, very close to the grid line which is fine. And the last vertex here is 6 across and 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 down, 6 across and 5 down. When we multiply by 3 becomes 18 across and 15 down. So you can now see we might want to look back after we've counted. So 18 across, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18. And then 15 down, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. And I'll mark that there, but the guideline isn't quite long enough because my ruler wasn't long enough. So I'm just going to extend that line and you can see that it does lie on the grid line, the guideline. So now I'll join up the vertices and you should be able to see by eye that this uh, triangle is an enlargement of the original. But... We can also measure the height of this triangle is 2, and an enlargement scale factor 3 means that the new height should be 6, correct. The width is 4, the new width should be 3 times that, which is 12. And it is. And the vertices are on the guidelines, so I know that that's a correct enlargement.